Welcome back, dear supporters, to 2025. With the new year, I've decided to focus on creating videos based on your requests from last year. In today's video, we'll be looking at how to add the NoPixel 4.0 inventory system to your server. Previously, we explored adding other inventory systems, but this one stands out with most of the bugs fixed and no longer requiring a wounding script to function. Let's dive in and get started. To kick off the process of integrating this exciting and dynamic update into your 5M server, start by visiting the GitHub page, which we've made easily accessible through the link provided in the video description. Once you're on the page, locate the necessary files and download them to your computer. After downloading, extract the contents from the zip folder to access all the required files. Once the extraction is complete, Carefully transfer the entire folder into the appropriate directory within your server's configuration that suits its structure and setup. This inventory system is specifically designed for the old QB core framework and is not compatible with the new framework. Please ensure your server is running the older version of QB core before proceeding with the setup. Before deleting the old QB inventory folder, navigate into the old folder, then go to the HTML directory and copy the folder named Images. Once you've copied it, paste it into the HTML directory of the newly added inventory folder. This ensures all your item images are retained. After completing this step, you can safely delete the old inventory folder. Finally, make a minor adjustment by renaming the folder. Simply remove the word main from the folder's name and your setup will be ready to move forward seamlessly. After extensive testing and productive discussions, I'm thrilled to announce that Rocketnode and Codeine are now official partners. We recognize the critical importance of providing top-tier hosting services to ensure your players enjoy an exceptional 5M experience. Rocketnode comes with DDoS protection, 24-7 support, and cloud backups. They offer extremely customizable 5M server hosting, allowing you to create your own server with just one click. Their easy-to-use control panel makes it simple to set up and modify your 5M server. If you're tired of searching for a reliable provider for your community, start building with Rocketnode today. Make sure to use the link in the description and get a 25% discount on your server by using the promo code provided below. Don't miss out on this great opportunity to enhance your server with a reliable hosting solution. Once you're in-game, you can start testing the new inventory system. Visit shops to purchase items, divide them into stacks, and experiment with the functionality. If needed, you can adjust the number of slots through the configuration options. Make sure to test the ammo and gun firing to ensure everything is working and properly synced. Unfortunately, the body health display on the left won't function, but honestly, it seems unnecessary. Also, ensure you don't get stuck on the inventory screen. Test dropping items to see if they appear correctly on the floor. Check out the glove box and stash system to confirm they're working as expected. If you face any issues, feel free to reach out on Discord for assistance. Keep in mind that this inventory system is designed for the older version of QB Core and won't be compatible with newly updated frameworks. That wraps up today's video. I hope this tutorial helps you integrate and test the new inventory system in your 5M server. If you have any questions or run into issues, don't hesitate to reach out on Discord. I'm here to help. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm thrilled to announce that Codeine has officially surpassed 7,000 members on Discord making it one of the best 5M developers and server owners hubs. Fueled by this increase in member count, we've added developer AI bots to help fix code snippets for users facing issues. Moreover, users can also create logos for their servers using our logo creating AI bots. With support for all frameworks from thousands of developers, you'll also find all the necessary free items needed to start a simple roleplay server. So what's stopping you from joining? Join now!